Hey guys, Martin speaking. Uh, welcome to this video. I'm um, I'm making this video in in conjunction with a post that I put on Facebook for the group Warhammer 40k for grown ups, um, where I'll put, put put a notice on there saying that I've, um, my desk's clearish at the moment. Obviously, I'm doing my Star Wars hammer um, bits and bobs. Um, but I've got no work in specifically, so I needed to get on with something, and my Nurgle army is all sat there unbuilt. So I put it out to the Facebook community as to what I should build next. And the options were number one, um, Heldrake, um, which will be my third Heldrake. And I can't show you the model, um, because obviously I've not built any of it yet. I've bought all the bits for it, I just haven't built the model. But this Heldrake's going to be the, the Heldrake directly from the book, um, from the picture from the book. So it's going to take some work, to be honest. Um, just. As we speak, trying to find it, so that's the image that I'd be going for. So he'll be on a Valkyrie with flames running through the Valkyrie, um, and obviously him all lit up as well. Um, it's a doable thing, it's going to look epic um, if I pull it off correctly. So that was option one. Um, option two was this guy, he's an Imperial Knight. Now I've opened the box, I've not built one of these before, guys. So. Um, this might not work. I'm obviously going to have to Nagleify him. <laughs> that being a word that all Nagle players know. Nagleify. Um, soon to be in the Oxford English Dictionary. Um, so I'm, if I do this guy, then what I'm going to do is I'm going to have his legs pinned backwards, um, more like the the Warhound Titan sort of look in the Ed 209 look. Um, and then I'm going to replace rather than having this gun, which is it's, it's a cool gun, but it's not very Nagel looking and and, and etc. So I'm going to put either um, just clip it together. Right, I'm going to put this one from the Tabergon set. Um, I forget what the gun's called, but it's, it's a huge, big, nasty gun that nobody uses, but it looks already quite Nagly, and then obviously I'll add a lot of green stuff to it. I'll probably take all the all the actual claws off it and just turn them into pustules um, and I have to give credit where credit's due this idea has come straight from Ace Face um, you go over and check Ace Face's channel out he's, he's the guy to go to for anything Tyranid based um, I've done a few Tyranid bits as of other people but he really knows what he's on about with these guys and he's making something quite exciting at the moment I won't spoil it um, but he gave me the idea of using that gun so it's either going to be that the gun off the exocrine head, which I've not got a spare one of yet, so I'm trying to allocate one of them just to see whether it would look better. Or I randomly have a spare gun from the Nagel Demon print in my mom, um, which is like the, the three barrel gun. I've not got it to hand for this video. Um, so it's going to be one of those guns on. And then basically, if I grab my clippers, let's clip this quickly. Um, Obviously this is the top piece of armour and the head for a nice fit within there. Um, obviously it's shielded and everything else in there. And I'm never ever going to use with my Tyranid armour, I'm never going to use the horror specs version. So I thought again, take the, the spiky bits off, but you know, how cool is that gonna look for the knight's head? That will make him suitably nagly with a lot of green stuff as well. So that's my idea for the Manegal Titan, uh, Manegal Knight, sorry, I should say. Um, that was option two, and then option three was these guys. Oh, Nick, if you're watching, I'll bring these in for you. I know you want them, so I'll bring them into the club. Um, I knew I had some more. These particular ones are the Plague Trolls. So these are going to be converted up into mutilators. Um, I'm going to give them all the different weapon options that I can possibly fit on. Um, and again, add a lot more green stuff to them. I've also got, and again I've not got in front of me in the camera, I've also got the Bile Trolls. Um, so these are the Plague Ogres, I've got the Bile Trolls. Um, they're going to make obliterators. I'm going to 
load them out with all the guns and they were option three now to be fair um much to my surprise i'll be honest number three is leading the way um, after only an hour in um, I'm, I'm nearly on to 40 different boats and the bio trolls the the, the obliterators and the, the mutilators are actually running the way but again the idea there is to take the, the main part of the model and probably just chop the arms off and cut this arm um, where i need to and then using a lot of green stuff and a lot of sculpting i'm going to mold in um, all the relevant parts of power fist, chain fists, um, hammers, what either all the options are, I can't think of them off the top of my head. I'm going to throw them all in there and that's it. So th this is only a video um, to go in conjunction with the Facebook group which is going to run for probably 24 hours, 48 hours even maybe until I get around to starting something. And it's just to give you guys an idea of um, an insight into my, my crazy mind for what I do conversion wise. Um, I'll obviously do whichever one wins and I, and I work on I'll do work on production videos going along with that anyway so thanks for watching guys please um, leave some comments below um, for, for what you're thinking if you've got any ideas to add to it I'll always look for ideas um, and please subscribe to the channel and share thank you very much and I'll see you in the next video